All together now, here we go. In three, two, one, go! All right, we are underway in the autonomous period in our world championship finals. Here we go. Vertex over there in the corner. Looking like they got hung up on that ground junction. We'll check up on them in a bit. Upper Creek Robotics has not been able to get going yet. So let's focus in over here on the Blue Alliance. Two cones on the high junction over there. Let's make that three. Excellent job over there from 14481. Doing some great work. I think they have five on there. Their alliance partner just loses track. Not able to get any more cones on that high junction, but that's okay. They already did some fantastic work over here as we are about to expire in auto. Drivers, pick up your controllers. Three, two, one. All right. The Jimison bots are going to get it going now over here. Here we go. We've got Upper Creek, and Upper Creek's trying to push. Vertex, their alliance partner, off of that ground junction. They're high centered right now. They're trying to push them off the ground junction, seeing if they can help them out. Meanwhile, over here, and they do manage to do so. That is how you do it here in first. All right, back over here on the blue alliance. We've got some excellent work over here. We've got Don't Bleak. They're trying to figure out where they want to go. They have a cone in their grasp, seeing where they can place it. Meanwhile, their alliance partner, Gator Bites, moving around carefully. They have a cone, haven't placed it yet. Red alliance with a cone on the high junction over there from Vertex. Upper Creek Robotics looking for a cone on the high junction for the Red Alliance as well. The Red Alliance really starting to pour it on now. Back over in the Blue Alliance. Don't Blink is sitting and waiting. This is a strategy. Some, pe some teams try to use this to claim more junctions. we got about 70 seconds remaining in this match. Here come the Gator Bites. There's another cone for the Blue Alliance on the mid-junction. The Red Alliance trying to pour it on, trying to counter the Blue Alliance. Here comes the Red Alliance Vertex cone on the mid-junction for the Red Alliance. The Blue Alliance trying to respond. Gator Bites. Trying to see if they can get this cone on the high junction, but something's going wrong. They're not able to line it up. They're trying to get it going over here. The Blue Alliance working on that high junction. Meanwhile, Vertex with a cone for the Red Alliance on the high junction over there. And their alliance partner does the same from Upper Creek Robotics. We're closing in on 35 seconds remaining. It's anybody's match, folks. Here we go. We got Don't Blink with a cone on the high junction for the Blue Alliance. We are now in the end game period. I see two beacons for the Red Alliance. I see two beacons for the Blue Alliance. The Blue Alliance with a beacon. The Red Alliance places a beacon on the high junction. Blue Alliance with a beacon on the high junction. Here come Don't Blink with a beacon on the mid junction over there. Upper Creek can't find where to put their cone. Can't find where to put their beacon. 10 seconds remaining. Teams are scrambling, folks. This is the finals of the world championship. Vertex trying to pour it on. Upper Creek seeing what they can do. They're maneuvering all across the field to park. And that is the match. Excellent finals match from those two sides. Do you want to see that score? Michelle, show me that score. Blue wins. Now looks like most of those points were in autonomous. A few of an edge for driver control, but a lot of it was autonomous, and both of them were really close on the end game.